see how I got this mask. Please stay tuned, and I really hope you like it. And if there's anything that you would like to know or see or whatever, for me, put it down there. Tweet me. Put it on my Instagram. Message me on my Tumblr. Whatever. Find me. Let me know what you want so I can get more of that out for you. Yeah? Okay. Bye. Enjoy the video. I'm using the Olay and CoverGirl Simply Ageless Concealer in 220 as my basic primer. It's kind of a light, you know, a paint pot in a way. For a transitional color, I'm going to use Soft Brown by MAC with a fluffy brush and pop that right into the crease. I'm taking an Essence eyeshadow and get ready. And it's like a taupey gray color, which I really love. I was wearing, when I first bought this years back, I wore it to death. It's <laughs> like, um, just a crease brush. Grab some of that. And apply it the same place we put the soft brown. I'm going to take a pencil brush just to get a little bit more color. And this is just the other thing. The other... This has a lot of fallout too, so I do my makeup last. But for the sake of the video, I did not. Take a time for the video, that's a check. And this would be like my everyday go-to for work makeup. And I'm going to take this pencil brush again and with a BH Cosmetics color in... BHMM03, it's like a slight gray, just a tad. This is pretty pretty, you could use black or whatever you want. I'm gonna put it on the outer corner just to smoke it out a little. Now for the lid, we're gonna use a mixture of um, Wet n Wild's Brulee and Max um, Samoa Silk, which is just like a peachy color. I'm going to lay down this color first with just um, a flat shader brush. I just keep losing everything. Like, I didn't just use all this. Okay. I'm going to line my eye and I'll be right. And put mascara on. I'm not using any falsies and I'll be right back to finish. The face. Okay, um, I forgot something when I was telling you about I was done. I forgot to tell you that I used um, one of the new Wet n Wild um, trios, the Muse and Carew's palette. I used the um, peachy color at the top for my highlight, so I'm sorry about that. So I'm just going to use my sleek palette in medium, my contra kit in medium. Uh, and find a brush and I want to use a little bit because I just want a light kind of I'm just going to use this brush here mm -hmm. not anything too much the Chanel uh, I don't know what it is Chanel I can't say it. I don't speak French. Joie, joie contrast mm. in Fandango. It's just like a a natural peachy blush color. It's a little has a shimmer to it. It gives just a little bit of color to it. I'm gonna go kind of nude. I'm gonna line my lips with just this boutique lip liner that I got at Sally's a long time ago. And it's called natural. I'm 
I forgot to use Milani's nude cream, which works pretty well for me with olive cleaner, so I'm not mad about that. I just find it dry. Maybe it's me. Ugh, Lord, that was awful. Do you want with this? It's up to you. I'm just gonna go with Perfect by NYX. This is their Mega Shine Gloss, which is my, this is my favorite. Yeah, all the products I use on my face and eyes and whatever else will be well. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching. I know I've been going for forever, but thank you for watching and sticking around if you have. Bye guys.